What's up, y'all? As you can see, we're working with IC Hair Company today. I've um, got this 10-inch bob lace front unit. And opening up the box, I got some wig caps and a care card. This is what the unit looks like out of the box. It's fire. I can't wait to play with it. It's got a huge parting space in the front, two combs on the side and one in the back. I'm going to go ahead and play with that new watercolor method that I've been seeing everybody do on YouTube. Hell, I don't know what I'm doing. I just know that I want to try it out. So I got some hair. I'm going to play with some colors. I'm going to separate the hair. Um, I'm going to put a little bit of dye into a big bucket with some water, mix it up, and I'm going to soak the hair in the dye. Now, um, I want to do two different colors, so that's why I parted the hair like that. So I got the results that I was looking for. I really wanted some blue hair. I don't think I've ever had this color before. It turned out perfect. It was like dark at the tips, lighter towards the root, ombre. Now I'm gonna mix two colors together to get purple. All right, now I definitely have not had purple hair like in a unit before. So I'm just gonna dip it in. And basically I'm just dipping it in a little bit, trying to keep the pieces separated and kind of like letting it soak for about five minutes each time. All right, so this is the final product. I love it. I love this watercolor method. It is really fire. Like if I would have known about this, I'd have been to this. So honestly guys, I used what I had on hand. Don't be like me. I just used some um, like tie dye um die because <laughs> it's all i had it's all your girl had i didn't i wasn't about to run to the store and and like do anything fancy but definitely go get you the right products for this when you want to do this but mine just happened to turn out good i just literally was like you know what let me just see what's gonna happen it was definitely an experiment it just turned out good i think um so i'm gonna go ahead and do the ball cap method and so i'll show you guys what i'm doing here just trying to get the front down so it just lays down super smooth and yeah All right, y'all, so on this part, I'm cutting down the actual cap back to my hairline. Now, my goal was to cut it back to where I didn't have much cap at all. Um, and I think I kind of probably should have left a little bit of cap there, but you know, it is what it is. We're just gonna work through it today, okay? We're just gonna work through it. I'm gonna add my got to be glued just in the front um, and a little bit of freeze blasting spray. I'm gonna go ahead and get this bad boy down and tack down the middle first and then we'll go ahead and work on the one side and the other side. I've learned that when I do it like this, instead of trying to do it all at once, it helps the wig stay on better. Um, so I've learned from watching videos and stuff on YouTube that you should do the middle first or pick a side and um, start there and then work your way around. So that's what I'm doing here. I'm just kind of using my blow dryer to help let that dry faster, pulling back pieces that are kind of getting stuck to my skin and stuck to each other because I want it to look very natural. <laughs> All right, y'all, so now it's time for the real fun. I'm gonna go ahead and take this unit to the next level by flat ironing it into some curls, just to kind of, you know, give it some balance and make it more playful. I'm really excited to see this blue show through and see how it mixes together. Y'all, this is the first time I've ever done this. I've never done this. I've never done like watercolor dyeing. I've never, this is my first time. So I'm really excited. I just wanna get there to the finish the final product and see what it looks like. I'm getting like bubblegum vibes. I'm getting like, you know, I don't know, unicorn vibes. But like, I just, I'm, I'm loving it. I'm just loving it, y'all. I'm just having fun and just playing around. And that's what hair is supposed to do. It's supposed to be playful and fun. All right, y'all, so this is the finished product. I really love the way that it turned out. I love that in the back, you can really, really see that blue. I think these colors go good together too. I don't know, let me know what you guys think. Um, if you guys would like to check out this hair from IC, please be sure to check out the links in the description box below, and we'll see you guys next video. Bye.